Hi guys, welcome to my channel. My name is Maria Soul, and today we're doing a Tarot 101 course and it is the beginning of the Cup Suits. Now, starting off, Aces are uh, beginnings. It is the first card in each suit and it basically just means the beginning of something, the start of something. That's pretty much the meaning. Um, and it's very singular, so it is, uh, it could be, it could symbolize you or the person that you're reading or someone that the person that you're reading for is talking of. And it usually means just the beginning of something. But it, like I said, it's singular, so it's not you and everybody else in the, in the, in your household is feeling this. No, it's you. This is just, it's singular. Now, um, also, if you notice, um, being that it's a cup side, a cups, cups, and cups usually means emotion. It's connected to water, and water is emotional. Uh, that's the connection to human, to humans. Um, and as you can see in this, the cup is overflowing. The water is coming out of it. It's, um, it's, it's, there's so much emotion. Now, when I mean emotion, I don't just mean, and it, yeah, there is a heart, so it does mean, it is connected to your emotions, but it doesn't necessarily mean a good emotion. It could be a bad emotion. It could mean something like sadness. It could mean anger. It could mean jealousy. But usually it means uh, a positive emotion, like joy, love. Uh, it is also connected to romance. Um, traditionally, that it normally means like, oh, an overflowing of emotion because you're falling in love with someone. Um, but it doesn't necessarily have to mean that. Again, uh, in other uh, videos that I've done, I've, I've said this before, that a lot of the cards, depending on the cards around, in whatever way that you're reading, uh, will determine the severity and or the direction of other cards. So it's the same with this one, so it doesn't necessarily mean that it's going to be romantic. It could mean that you have an overflow of, of, of sadness because of something that happened. And the other cards will delegate what that would be. But usually, traditionally, it's uh, romantic or love uh, or joy uh, in that, in a very positive sense. Obviously, if you read reversals, which is when the card is upside down, um, that could mean that you lack emotion, that you're not feeling emotion, that you're not um, connecting with your emotions, that you're sort of disconnected, and you're not letting, uh, or you're not letting an emotion flow out, you're holding it uh, back. So the the ace of all the aces can give you um, a very interesting um, readings, and you can really delve into that since it's more singular. So it's just one person, and it's not you're not reading what's going on with one person, and then everybody else is around you. So uh, it's it's just singular. Now let's move on to the two of cups. Now, remember how I said that the Ace of Cups is all about, ro it, um, traditionally it's about romance and coming together and dating and falling in love? Well, the two um, is usually this is just that. It's that emotion coming from the Ace that you were very much in love and happy and whatnot. Then you have the two and that's you connecting with that emotion with someone else. You and that other person have similar co uh, emotions that uh, work together uh, positively and can become something more and you can work with that and that's what this usually means and it also again traditionally since it is a guy and a girl it does traditionally mean a romance um, it's obviously not as strong as the lovers because the lovers is more soulmates uh, people that were destined to come together in my opinion, that's how it usually um, pans out. Where the Two of Cups, it just means, uh, it can mean a good, strong friendship and a good, strong connection with someone. It doesn't necessarily mean that that person is your soulmate. Though, again, depending on the cards around, depends on um, if, that, if that is the case. Uh, reversals, uh, very similar. 
it usually, for me, it would mean more of the sense that you are not connecting with that other person. You are desisting yourself from a person who has the same feelings for you. So it, for me, it's mostly somebody who's very timid and doesn't want to tell like the guy or the girl that they like, that they like them, but that other, that other person also likes them. And they're just not coming together. It's not, it's not, you know, it's not jiving really well. So that's the two. Now the three is when things are finally coming together and um, you are celebrating that romance or that love or that emotion, that, uh, that joy and putting it together and becoming um, and, and sort of spreading it around. So it's instead of it just being between you and your friend or you and that one person, it's, hey guys, look, me and this person are working out and we're doing good. Let's spread the love. I want to spread it out for everybody and like just express it. And that's kind of what the three of cups usually means for me anyways. I have had friends though that see it as your friends being jealous of um of your uh of your happiness. I don't see how that could be the case, but in none of the cards that I've seen have have that have 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 it ever been that way. Has it ever been that way? But I guess you could see it as reversal in some way. Um, because for me, reversal would be more that you're, you're being happy and you're like, yay, look at me. And everybody else is like, that's cool. I want to still mope in my own depression. So, you know, it's like they don't want to celebrate with you. Um, that's how I would normally see it or just be like, hey, you know, keep certain things to yourself about your happiness and your relationship and your your connectivity with friends um so that's how i see the three um other than that guys that is pretty much the first three cards let's move this a little bit the first three cards in the cup series uh the next video will be the next three cards which will be the four five and six of cups and I hope you guys stay tuned to watch that. Other than that, guys, much love and blessings.